How are you doing? How are you doing? I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Give me a pizza. I want a pizza. Give me a pizza. I like pizza. Hello and welcome back to Nexus Games, where our prices are low and our standards are lower. We are still playing Hotline Miami, so we are going to get right back into it as soon as my girlfriend gets out of the damn bathroom. You know, it's been like at least 50 minutes. You know, I've, I've got work. You know all that food you've been eating in the fridge? Well, I guess, I guess it's mostly just been pizza. But you know who's been paying for that pizza? That'd been me. Uh, you haven't been doing anything. So, uh, I think I deserve a little time in the tub. Or, you know, something. Are you even in there? Damn it, she fell asleep in the tub again. We're gonna have a long talk after this. Hi, it's Don from Hotel Blue. Uh, we need you tonight. Our receptionist went home due to stomach problems, and we have some VIPs who will be staying with us today. Make sure you give them a great stay. That will be your top priority this evening. Now get going. Hello? Can I, can I punch you? You looked at me. That's enough reason to punch you, I think. I start with a knife. Yes, please. I like knives. Is there anybody here? No. Okay. Oh, they got guns all over the place. Oh, what a horrible way to die. On the toilet. Just like Elvis. Wait a second, he's not dead, is he? Oh, I am too fast for you. Is there anybody else? Um, do I need to kill that guy? I probably do. Gotcha, okay. Stage clear, any weapons I want? No, okay. Up and in. Oh, let's go the way that this arrow is pointing. Sidle, sidle, sidle. Okay, janitors everywhere just need to not be creepy. Can you guys handle that? No, that's not what I wanted. Wait, what? Why wouldn't it go through? All right, look at me creepily. Hmm. Dot, dot, dot. Mass. <sighs> creepy, creepy janitors. Oh. Love this gun. If only it could shoot through windows. Oh, uh, that's not what I want. Uh, let's... Really? Cool, gotcha. Again, dude, really sorry. Not a great way to die at all. But kind of getting paid for this. So, hoja! Man, I'm a horrible person. Lots of exposure. I am very good at exposing myself. Give me that chance and yeah, I will shoot sharp and double expose. I think everybody knows exactly what that means no matter the context, right? Man, VHS, the days of rewinding. Hey, my man, boy, am I glad to see you. Have you been following the news about the killings? Now this is top secret. You can't tell anyone, but I have a friend who's in the police force. He told me there's rumors going around that there could be more than one perp. Maybe a whole bunch. A group of people wearing masks, killing Russians. It's like it's from a movie or something, right? Well, I think it's fascinating. I'm gonna call you Hipster Harry. See you later, Hipster Harry. I guess I could call him Harry Hipster and it would be just as relevant. Honey, I will be back late. 
Uh, I left some money on the counter for... I don't know, I'm feeling Chinese tonight. Maybe Indian food. Ooh, I haven't had Indian food in a long time. Uh, you know what, you, you just pick. Uh, we had sushi last night, though, so I'm kind of not really feeling sushi right now. But, uh, yeah, just get something that isn't, that isn't heroin. And, uh, yeah, we'll be square. Toodles. Time to dance. Yeah. There's been a small change of plans. We have a prank caller at the telephone company. Why don't you go there and see if you can talk some sense with him? You know what I mean. 342 Northwest Street. Go there now. Floor it. Okay. Out here to the car. Someone is already here. Hmm. Wow, he did some real work. Your dead mate. Oh. Mm. oh! Oh, come on now. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Ugh, throw it at me again. Throw it at, throw it at me. Come on, throw it, throw it at me. No, you want to. You know you want to. You get away from me. <laughs> oh, what? I can't even pick it up? Grab. Watch him. Just watch him. You stay back, son. Urgh. No, no. Bad. Bad motorcycle man. Nope. Uh. Oh, frickin' frackin'. Okay, I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning. Oh, I'm not learning. Got. Getcha. Get some. Throw it again. Throw it again. Yeah, do it. Mm. Throw it. Stop it. Oh. Yeah, get that thing out of the wall. This can't be happening. I can't win like now. Not like this. So close. Boom! Hole in one, if you ask me. Ted? That does not look like a Ted. That looks like a. I don't know. A Maggie. A Maggie. Or a, a Marley, maybe? How about a drink? It's on me. Uh, okay, as long as it's not arsenic. 
Where is everyone? This used to be a hip hoppin' club. Ugh. So, you came back. How are you feeling? You look... ill. Maybe you should see a doctor. I told you not to come back here. You see that my opinion of you doesn't matter. You see? If you insist on returning here, then I should leave. Have you thought about what I asked you last time? I'm not here to give you any answers. Questions are all I have to offer a man like you. If you're not feeling well, maybe you should rest. Some things work out best when you don't try so hard. No matter who you are, bearing too much weight inevitably leads to the collapse of everything. Next time we meet will be the last. I can see it in your eyes. Before you go, I'll leave you with three predictions. Someone you know is not who you think he is. Something will soon be taken from you. On July the 21st, you will wake up in a bigger house. That is all. <sighs> well, I could use a bigger house. One with two bathrooms, preferably. Alright, well that's gonna do it for this particular episode of Hotline Miami. So, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you all next time. So, stay beautiful, and stay tuned for more Nixus.